Adolf Hitler 1889-1945 was a prominent figure in history infamous for his role as the Chancellor of Germany and the leader of the National Socialist German Workers' Party, commonly known as the Nazi Party. He played a pivotal role in leading Germany into World War II and implementing policies that led to the Holocaust, resulting in the genocide of millions of innocent people. This biography aims to provide a comprehensive account of his life while refraining from glorifying or promoting his actions. Early Life Adolf Hitler was born on April 20, 1889, in Braunau am Inn, Austria-Hungary now Austria. He was the fourth of six children to Anwar Hitler and Clara Pölzel. Hitler's childhood was mocked by financial struggles and a strained relationship with his father, who often disapproved of his artistic ambitions. Young Adolf had an interest in fine arts, but his father pushed him towards a career in the civil service. Ambitions and struggles. At the age of 18, Hitler moved to Vienna to pursue a career as an artist. However, he faced significant challenges, and his dreams of becoming a successful painter never materialized. During his time in Vienna, he developed a strong sense of national identity, anti-Semitic views, and extreme nationalist sentiments, influenced by various racial ideologies and political movements of the time. Military service in World War I in 1914, with the outbreak of World War I, Hitler enlisted in the Bavarian Army and served as a soldier on the Western Front. He received several awards for bravery, but was wounded twice during the war. It was during his service that he grew to hate the Treaty of Versailles, which he later believed to be responsible for Germany's economic and political instability. Rise to Power after the war, Hitler joined the German Workers' Party DAP, which later transformed into the National Socialist German Workers' Party NSDAP or Nazi Party. He quickly rose within the ranks and became the party's leader in 1921. Hitler's charisma, powerful oratory skills, and ability to tap into the frustrations of the German people, especially those affected by economic hardships, contributed to his popularity. The Nazi regime in 1933, Adolf Hitler was appointed Chancellor of Germany, and he swiftly consolidated power. He initiated various policies, including the suppression of political opponents, censorship, and the implementation of the Enabling Act, which effectively gave him dictatorial powers. Under his rule, the Nazis pursued an aggressive expansionist foreign policy, ultimately leading to the outbreak of World War II in 1939. The Holocaust and War Crimes One of the most notorious aspects of Hitler's regime was the Holocaust, a systematic and state-sponsored genocide of six million Jews and millions of other innocent people, including Romani people, disabled individuals, Poles, Soviets, and others. The Holocaust remains one of the darkest chapters in human history, and its memory stands as a stock reminder of the consequences of hatred, prejudice, and unchecked power, decline and defeat. As World War II progressed, Hitler's military decisions proved disastrous for Germany. The war efforts took a significant toll on the country, and the Allied forces began to close in on Nazi Germany. In April 1945, with defeat imminent, Hitler retreated to his underground bunker in Berlin. On April 30, 1945, he committed suicide by gunshot, along with his longtime companion Eva Braun, as the Soviets captured the city. Legacy Adolf Hitler's legacy is one of infamy and devastation. He is remembered for his role in orchestrating the Holocaust and initiating World War II, which led to the deaths of millions and caused untold suffering. The atrocities committed under his leadership serve as a stock reminder of the potential consequences of unchecked extremism hate and the abuse of power. It is essential to study and understand Hitler's life and actions to ensure that such dot chapters are not repeated in history. Learning from the past can help humanity strive for a more tolerant, just, and peaceful future.